Hey, thanks for tuning in to Leroy Scott TV. I am your relationship coach, and today I've, I've rolled my sleeves up because I've got two issues that I want to talk about that literally have to do with rolling your sleeves up, getting busy, and really realizing and taking responsibility for what needs to happen in order to change these things in your life. First of all, I want to talk about why men cheat. That's right, I want to talk about it. Men, I'm putting it out there, I'm putting it on the table. Why I'm in cheat. Now, I'm only going to give you three points on this video, but I want you to go to my website, www.leroyscott.com. I want you to get, um, I want you to go to my blog and I want you to read the rest of this article on why men cheat. And then I want you to connect to my website because I'm always putting men's business on the street, right? I'm always putting it on the street. I'm going to put it out there because I believe as a man myself, I want to be accountable to being faithful to my family. I want you to be accountable to your family. And I believe we can win. I believe we can defeat the enemy. So I'm putting it out on the table. Number one reason men cheat is this. They feel unappreciated, ladies. They don't feel like you appreciate them. And when a man doesn't feel appreciated, it's just not like when a woman doesn't feel appreciated because women don't feel appreciated. And what they do is they complain about it. When a man doesn't feel appreciated, he always thinks about a way out of that relationship or he always thinks about getting appreciation from another woman. That's just the way men work. Men don't know how to go in a room, be quiet, and just cry and complain. When they feel unappreciated, it hits the core of their being. And out of that feeling comes the idea or the possibility that there's some other woman out there that can appreciate them. Now, how do you appreciate your man? You basically appreciate your man by telling your man cool stuff, telling him good things about yourself, about himself, letting him know that he's the bomb, letting him know that he's the man. If you don't do that, then men are very timid creatures. They look bad and strong, but they're really not. They're really timid. They hurt quickly, easily. They fracture very easily. So you got to keep pouring into him. You got to keep letting him know that he's your champion. He's your man. You got to keep letting him know, even if he's not good at stuff, you got to keep telling him that he is because they need to feel appreciated. Number two, they often feel emotionally disconnected. Now, many women say, you know, it's hard for me to connect with my man emotionally because men don't have emotions. That is a downright not true deal. It's simply not true. Men are bursting with emotions. As a matter of fact, if he really let you inside of his emotions, you could not even handle the guy because he is so emotional. Now, watch this. They feel emotionally disconnected. You're saying that you can't connect with him emotionally, and he's feeling emotionally disconnected. What do you do? Relax. Calm down. Cool down. Don't let your emotions get all over the place because you're going to lose the guy. Number three, this is the real deal. The reason men cheat. At the end of the day is because men choose to cheat that's right I said it regardless of these other two excuses or all the things you'll read at the end of the day every man has a choice to make and every man doesn't make the choice to cheat so there you go that's why men cheat roll your sleeves up get serious about your relationship let your man know that you appreciate him Emotionally connect with him. And at the end of the day, if he chooses to cheat, it's his choice and his choice alone. www.leroyscott.com. I am rolling my sleeves up and going to battle because you are going to win. Check me out. God bless you and God keep you. We'll see you next time.